Good afternoon. This is Carla, and I am here with some beautiful cards from Mary Israel. She sent this lovely card. Well, I should say lovely note, and it says here are some more cards. Hope it will help the cause. They're in bundles of four, and the fifth one is set aside so that I can show them to you. Some are repeats of the first batch that she sent, which I'm ashamed to say I had not had a chance to film yet. So you're gonna be seeing those today as well. And this was the lovely card that she made and is it with us. And you could see several of the bundles out here in front of me and I'm gonna show them individually to you up front. This is a beautiful nativity. I am absolutely in love with this die myself. Jesus is the reason for the season. Is that not the truth? You cannot have Christmas without Christ. Cards by Mary. It's lovely. I love that, Mary. I'm glad you got your own stamp set there. Or on stamp. So everybody knows they're from you. Oh, this is lovely. This is the year of cheer paper from last year. May your Christmas sparkle with joy and happiness. Lovely Christmas bubbles and snowflakes here. And this is like a linen back here. Champagne color. That's very pretty. And we have snowflakes. Hope your season brings one good thing on top of another. Wouldn't it be amazing if we could get blessings and happiness like we do snow, huh? All right, and here is the next one. This is, again, it's more of the uh, year of cheer from last year. It's beautiful. And I don't care if they say that they're retired. They're still beautiful products, and we should use them for as long as we want. Thinking of you at Christmas, this embossed, she did a very good job, and this is like the glitter paper here. Seasons, greetings, and all good wishes for the coming year. How beautiful. Lovely job, Mary. I mean, these are exceptional. And here we have a lovely little Frosty. How cute with the gold ribbon. Oh, and it frays out good so that it has a, a good look there at the end, the distressed. It looks so cute. She matted everything perfectly. Merry Christmas and best wishes for the coming year. She even colored the little snowman in here. So cute. Cards by Mary. Lovely. Love this. Oh, and this is one of those stamp sets. I really wanted this set and the punch that went with it because it was so versatile. So, so many different ways and... I guess groups that it would fit and make very happy. A uh, merry little wish, and this is the the hall. Oh, deck the hall, season of Christmas, fa la 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 la. That's lovely. Happy, wonderful Christmas. It's beautiful. You know, I I notice some of them say our Christmas cards we have seen in the past. Some say Happy Christmas, and some say Merry Christmas, and I I believe that people over in the UK say Happy Christmas, like they take holidays, where we in America take vacations and we have a Merry Christmas, just one of those silly little words that we all do different. This is beyond amazing, look at that. She distressed it perfectly. What a awesome job, Mary. A very Merry Christmas to you. Looks like the um, the tree from, I can't even think of the name now. Season of Tree or something. But that that's the first stamp set that I ever purchased, and I love it. And I go back to it every year, too. So this is lovely. I love that. May the simple joys of the season be yours. And a Merry Christmas. I believe this is the new one out this year. It has a punch and then all the different designs for the little baubles. It's very cute. This is a beautiful old Victorian antique looking Christmas paper. May the simple joys of the season be yours. Just lovely, Mary. Gorgeous card. You can see the time and attention and the love that went into these. So now we've got some Beautiful little, um, I started to say acorns, but it's not acorns. It's, uh, oh gosh, my mind is gone. Okay, I'm going to pass that up because I, I can't, I've lost the word. But anyhow, those lovely little things you collect under the pine cones, 
and oh there you go it's a pine cone so there we are they're underneath the pine trees with the little boughs this is lovely beautiful beautiful die cutting there and she's lifted this with just enough dimension to put the uh, the foliage hanging out underneath may the simple joys of the season be yours that's really beautiful i love that that's this might belong to that farmhouse paper set, I'm wondering, because it has that look. It's very lovely. And here we have a Merry Christmas. And what a fine die. I bet that was very difficult to pull out without tearing up. That is just beautiful. I love that. And the beautiful ribbon. She did a great bow here, too. And again, I, I will apologize. I know my handshake. And this one's on cream. We don't have anything inside there. Oh, she forgot to stamp this one. That's beautiful, beautiful card. Oh, I think this will have to be one of my favorites. I love navy and white for Christmas cards. And the glitter, that's just beautiful. I think that's the dazzling diamonds paper here. It's really, really great. She's punched out the little moon and stars. Oh, we have little blue trees inside. I think that's from that, from that wood set. It's like the, it's the mountains and the water and so forth. But anyhow, it looks great inside there. That's beautiful. Oh, this is great one. This is the, uh, the embossing folder that looks like wood with the planks. You can even see the indentions of the, the cores of the wood. Great job. I'm, I'm guessing, tell me if I'm wrong here, Mary, but I'm guessing you stamped this and then embossed it because it's so perfect. That's just beautiful, beautiful. Tis the season, with little stitch rectangles here. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Look at that. So beautiful. Christmas blessings. I like this paper. We've got the little tinsel all over the little tree and the balls. A beautiful star on the top. May the simple joys of the season be yours. That's beautiful. I love that one. Oh, beautiful. Got another little frosty here and she's put some shiny stuff and some little jewels on his hat. He is Looking pretty swift out there. Look at that, that sheer ribbon there. Peace, joy, and love. Isn't that what we all want for Christmas? That's something. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Indeed. I hope you all do. A merry little wish. I love this. I would have never thought to put mint macaroon on a Christmas card, but this, this looks great. I love this. It's a wonderful look. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. It's lovely. Which I want to point out something. I don't know if you had seen my message on our Facebook group this week, but I actually got some feedback from one of the patients who received the cards here in America thanking us for them. And your name on the back of these really gives them an opportunity to see who you are. And don't be surprised if you get an email from somebody saying they received a card that you made. This is beautiful. This I believe this was the spring foils. And the Merry Christmas, the pine cones. That is just amazing. I love the brass though. That always gets me. And then she's embossed with the silver here. Wonderful job, Mary. Sending you joy to you. Sending you joy to you. There you go. It's really pretty. And let it snow. That's a cute little frosty inside the snow glow. And look at the little dots of snow floating in the air. Again with the mint macaroon and like the gray wood. That's lovely. Oh, she did the little dots in here too. Well, I, don't, I think they might be little snowflakes. It's very beautiful. Very good job. Oh, and here's another beautiful traditional Christmas. This looks like a country Christmas here with the plaid 
and with joy. I love that. With loving wishes for a bright and beautiful season. I think that is old olive, if I'm correct. That looks good. That's perfect for old-fashioned Christmas. This is lovely. Look at that. All the berries and the three different kinds of ribbon. I'm thinking this might have been one of our weekly challenges on our Facebook group because we had one with ribbons going across. So I'm just guessing that she might have made this card that week. May happy moments and cherished memories surround you with joy this season. That's really beautiful. It's a wonderful job, Mary. I love that. Oh, here's another one with these lovely, <laughs> I love this punch because I believe you can make what Eskimos, Santa, uh, you can have the reindeer. It seems like there was something else. I can't think of what it was at the moment, but these are just adorable with the little pink and blue bows. So cute. That's a beautiful satin ribbon too. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. So cute. Jingle, jingle, and jingle, jingle. Merry Christmas wishes. Beautiful matched green rhinestones here. Looks like she may have watercolored this. Either that or with the uh, colored pencils. Very nice job. Love that. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. That's a lovely one, Mary. Makes me want peppermint. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. Look at these beautiful stars and then the music on craft and the ornaments. This is a wonderful job. I really, this one's stunning, Mary. I really love it. Hope your season brings you one good thing on top of another. How oh, great. Love that. Oh, this is the cult one. I love this when it came out last year. It's all the individual pieces, so you can mix and match the different pieces. Like if you cut the dye out three or four times with different colors, but she did a great job placing it like this. It really makes it shine. And this red here has a linen texture to it as well. And this Merry Christmas. Wonderful job. She did a great, great job with this one. I love it. May the simple joys of the season be yours. And this is the stamp set that goes with the quilt. I think it was maybe Merry Quilt or Christmas Quilt or something. I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong. When you go off my memory, now you're asking for trouble. <laughs> oh, this is a lovely one too. I believe this is the old olive. We've got a lovely tree decorated here with little red tinsel in there. And the stitch circle. It says Merry Christmas. I like the font there too. It's very nice. Seasons, greetings, and all good wishes for the coming year. Wow, does that not look classy or what? Awesome job, Mary. I mean, that really shines. It's red grid green ribbon. I believe that's cherry, the cherry cobbler grid game. Oh, this is another beautiful paper here. I don't recall seeing this one. I'm not sure which pack that came from. But that is beautiful. And I, I'm thinking that's like the stitch rectangles. And then tis the season. And I believe this is um, with coloring pencils there. She did a good job. The uh, snowman looks like he might have a little bit of rough arms there. <laughs> that's kind of like my legs in the morning, y'all. Let's see. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. That's a very good sentiment. It kind of fits everything, doesn't it? Here is a beautiful poinsettia. Love the holly with the berries. She did a wonderful job. She molded these leaves individually. Look at that. Wow. Your work is seen and it is noticed and appreciated, Miss Mary. That is beautiful. And sending every good wish for the coming year. New Year, excuse me. That's really pretty. Great job. Really great job. And our last one here is Merry Christmas. And we have a beautiful sleigh full of little gifts with bows. That is really something. She did a wonderful job. These are beyond amazing, Mary. Thank you so very much for 
all you did for these families. They're going to be going to diabetes victims and people who are dealing with autism on a daily basis. And I just want to say thank you. I will, I have another group of cards I will be putting up in a few moments from Lucinda Schaefer. So um, hang around or check back on the channel and you can see those in a few moments. Thank you and have a good day.